get to it. And I'm almost there. Well, I'm thankful for that. Glad to know that he lives inside. Glad to know that I'm born again. What a peace. So many memories on this mountain, and it's good to be back. And thank you all so much for supporting the inspirations of Troy Burns family and being with all of us. And it's, we're just tickled to death to be here. To my right and to uh, your left, this is my pastor, and I'm tickled to death to have him on board and singing along and doing such a great job. And I appreciate his walk to the Lord and what a blessing he is. He's my brother. Y'all make Mr. Chad Edwards welcome to see you. And this young gentleman standing behind him there, uh, he comes from down in Georgia, South Georgia. We're tickled to have him. Many of you see him a lot on Facebook, playing the piano and singing and doing a great job. This is Mr. Silas Fuller. Y'all make Silas welcome to see him. Glad to have him up in the stand. This big guy back here with this big guitar, that's all I don't have to describe him. He's a big guy, but boy, he's got a he's got a gentle kind of heart and uh, loves the Lord with all his heart and uh, such a server for Jesus. And uh, we're honored to have him on board picking that big bass for us. This is Mr. Mitch Gallion from Sweetwater, Tennessee. And to my left and your right, this young fellow that stands here, we're awful proud of him as well and doing such a fine job and uh, so proud to have him on board and uh, loves the Lord and I uh, see it in his life. And as a young as a young fella, I tell you what, it's, it's good to see these young folks taking on and, and keeping the torch lit. Yeah, singing gospel music and singing songs that are real. And uh, we're, we're tickled to have him as well. And he's got a lot of folks here today. Uh, he kind of looks a little bit familiar. A lot of people said last week, said, that looks like Isaac. He looks just like him. That's Isaac. I said, no, it's not. I said, that's his younger brother. This is Mr. Elisha. <laughs> Mr. Elisha Moore. And uh, we're just uh, loving doing what we're doing and singing some new songs and old songs. But the main thing is to sing songs that has a message and the power. And I uh, want to be found real in what we're doing. But uh, many of you may remember, of course, this is kind of a bittersweet thing for me in a way. Many of you know that I travel with the Primitive Quartet for many years, almost 30 years. Love those guys. And some of them hold me around this week. Yeah. Yeah. Many of, you would, many of you would come and share your weekend and you'd come over here for a few nights and then you'd come over to Hominy Valley and back over here. And uh, But uh, we certainly miss those times. But uh, all the guys love you. Everybody's doing well. And hopefully some of them might be around this weekend as well. But uh, I thought about this song here and uh, what a blessing it's been. And I remember Norman singing it many, many times. And uh, Elisha started singing it. What a blessing it is. And uh, listen to the words of this. It's entitled, More Precious Than Gold.
Facebook and different things, but uh, been in the hospital quite a bit here in the last little bit with my mom. Mom graduated to go home to be with the Lord just a few weeks back. And through all of that, well, I've seen God's grace and His mercy and His love pick us up when we least expected it. And uh, we were by the bedside one one evening there. And I, sometimes I wonder why things happen the way they do, but then again. He's God. He knows what we need. Me and Chad was there. Chad rode up to visit Mom. She began to raise.